Hi, Tom here with a new Circle Line Art School video. For this simple drawing, using one point perspective, start by drawing a horizontal line across your page, and then a dot in the centre of the horizontal line for the vanishing point, the point where all parallel receding lines will look like they go towards. Next, we can draw a rectangle around the vanishing point, keeping the horizontal lines horizontal and parallel to the horizon line and keeping the vertical lines vertical and parallel to the vertical line of the edge of the paper. So now we can just draw a baseline for the rectangle. Next we can use the vanishing point and draw a line coming towards us from the bottom right of the door frame. And then another line from the left hand base of the door frame again towards us. Next, we can draw the thickness around the door frame on the top, the left, and the right side of the door frame, but not the base. You could add an extra set of lines to the thickness too. Next, using the vanishing point, we could extend the hallway beyond the door frame and away from us, the viewer, using the vanishing point as a guide. Then choose where you want to place a door frame in the distance and draw a horizontal line and then the two vertical lines and then using the vanishing point and the corners of the first door frame, we can find out the height of the second door frame using one point perspective. So this is one point perspective because we've got one vanishing point and that's in the centre, more or less the centre of the drawing. We could just darken some lines too. Next, for the door frame in the distance, we can add the same sort of door frame detailing around it, but it will be smaller and narrower and probably a good idea to have the pencil sharper so the liners are thinner at a distance. Next, using the vanishing point, we can draw a line from the top left of the door frame coming towards us, and then another line from the top right of the door frame coming towards us again. Next, you could extend the hallway, but I think I'll draw a closed door on the second door frame. So just two sort of panels of a door frame, and then a dot for the door handle. We could add some horizontal lines to the floor, which will have bigger gaps as they come nearer us, the viewer of the image. And then once we've got these horizontal lines on the floor, we could draw some receding lines using the single vanishing point for this drawing in one point perspective to find out where these receding lines will recede to. Now all of these receding lines are parallel to each other. That means that they're all going to use the same vanishing point, the single vanishing point in the centre of the drawing. Once you've done this, you could perhaps shade in some of the tiles to make a checkered pattern. And then to finish this drawing, you might like to add a window or a picture on the side of the wall using the vanishing point for the receding lines and keeping the upright lines vertical and also parallel to the edge of the paper that you're drawing on. To find out more details about how to draw using perspective, please visit my website circlelineartschool.com where you will find details of my online drawing courses. Thanks for watching and see you next time.